The case involving Senator Rochester Zakoracha and the Imo State government is for the forfeiture of properties alleged to have been acquired illegally by the former governor while in office. Counsel to Senator Okoracha, Mr. Ubama Rabuchi, a senior advocate of Nigeria, told the court, presided over by Justice Ahmed Mohammed, that the properties of his client are being marked for confiscation and demolition already. He praised the courts to issue an interim order to the EFCC and the Imo State government not to carry on with their action. The application, however, could not go through, following a motion by the council to the Imo State government and the EFCC challenging the jurisdiction of the court to sit on the matter during the vacation period. In their separate submissions, the EFCC and the Imo State government described the application by Okoracha as an abuse of judicial process and could not subsist in view of the motion filed already challenging the jurisdiction of the court to hear the matter during vacation period. They argue that once an issue of jurisdiction is raised in any suit, it must be determined and resolved first before the court can take further steps. In his judgment, Justice Ahmed Mohammed refuses to grant Okoracha's application on the grounds that he would have to hear the motion challenging his jurisdiction to sit on the matter during vacation. After the sitting, counsel to Okoracha shares his view on the ruling. I wanted it on record that we are afraid that something could happen to my client's properties in our way. So let the court know that we, that apprehension exists. Even though he ruled against me, but it is now on record that we are afraid. But the council to the Imo State government has a different view. Oh, Imo State now says, these properties now belong to us. Go to court and challenge it. Go to court and say, no, I own this property, not you. That's the way it should be done. The matter has been adjourned to the 24th of August 2021 for hearing on the motion challenging the court's jurisdiction.